Sunshine's Quality Assured Collisions Weekly Bite is sponsored by Sunshine's Quality Assured Collision. Welcome back to the show. Uh, always a pleasure to see our next guest. We say it all the time. This is one of the best places in Vancouver to go and have uh, a dinner with friends, romantic dinner, whatever you want. Great view, incredible food. And we are joined now, you've met him on the show before, by Chef Dino Gazzola. How are you from, I'm of course, excellent. the observatory uh, at Grouse Mountain? Yeah, all right, man. You cut your hair off. I cut my hair off, yeah. yeah first things you. first, where's first the ponytail? The ponytail's Who gone. Who are you? Still the same man, just with a lot less hair. Okay, I hear go. there were some <laughs> lamentations from the women folk. When uh, you, uh, perhaps them. there were a few. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, tell us first of all. I mean, we're going to talk about the food, the restaurant, obviously, but uh, I know it is just dumping snow up on Grouse right it's, now. When I was leaving this morning, it was coming down in buckets. It yeah. was good, yeah. So we've got a good base now, well-groomed. It's uh, And lots of beautiful. fresh stuff over the past lots, 24 yeah. hours. Now let's yeah. take, so before we start cooking, yeah. let's take people on a little a little tour of uh, some pictures if they haven't been up to the restaurant before. Of course, we've got a gorgeous picture yeah. of Grouse, but tell us how people get up to the restaurant and what they'll experience. There's ample parking down at the base. You take the sky ride uh, up top, a uh, short eight-minute trip to get up top, uh, and right now you're getting up there to like some stunning winter conditions. Look that's at yeah. the views from yeah. up there. I mean, yeah. that's the thing that, uh, you know, if you're up there on a winter night and it clears up enough for you to see the city, it mm. feels like yeah. you can reach that's out and touch amazing. it. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah, it's yeah. absolutely stunning. Yeah. Okay, uh, you guys are doing dine-out right now. We are, in fact, doing dine-out, yes. Uh, you want to sort of walk us through the, the menu and, and what you're doing, or is it the whole menu? And it's you just... the whole menu. One of the items we're doing today is one of the desserts off the menu. Mm -hmm. So it's our vanilla uh, creme brulee with some uh, Armagnac stewed prunes, some uh, orange zest, and some honey ice cream. Sounds delicious. Where do we begin? We begin. I've just scalded off some milk and cream right now. Okay. And this is simple resi. Anyone can do this at home. It's fabulous. So uh, oh, we're just going to yeah, take that. Yeah, I hear that about creme brulee all yes. the time. Dino. I'd rather come to the restaurant it's, and yeah, have a pro proof. do it. Creme brulee. It's a snap. That's why you see it, it at your friend's snap. dinner parties all so what the time. Do you, what is this technique you're doing here? Right now, I'm just tempering the egg yolks. If I were to just take these uh, egg yolks and add it to the... Scrambled. It was scrambled, yeah. You're going to have scrambled eggs, exactly. And Anyone can scramble eggs. Gross <laughs> right. when it comes to desserts. Yeah, exactly. So. Very few ingredients here, just eggs and uh, sugar, cream and milk, and some vanilla bean. Easy peasy. Yeah, so, and this is another thing, you can do this the day in advance, let it sit in your fridge when you're having your big soiree, pull it out mm -hmm. the next day, get the oven ready to go and you're laughing. And away you go. God, yeah. You, give me a, you make this all seem so simple, you know, this Years is, this is why you're in business, Years my friend. Experience. Now, for those who haven't enjoyed uh, the food on the menu at the observatory, tell us what other items that you've got going on at this time of year. This time of year, we're just about to transition to our, our new menu coming up. So uh, again, it's all about seasonality and uh, what's regional, what's available right now. Mm -hmm. Going a little bit more, getting a little more of the offal on there this time of year, putting a little beef tongue on there maybe. Something beef tongue? More. Yeah. That was my dad's favorite. Well, and Dad what I love <laughs> about what you guys do, I mean, obviously everybody talks about seasonality yeah. and, and local produce yeah. and, and all that kind of stuff, but to be able to see the city, to be in the heart of it, and this unique place that we all enjoy and that we all it love. It definitely is inspiring. Uh, you know, it's, it's just fun to be up yeah. there and know that that you're getting things that are representative of what's You can what's see it all right in front of you. Yeah. The valley's all right there. It's all right Okay, available. so what do we do with these so little bad boys? So here, I poured them in these little ramekins. You can buy these at the store. Everyone has them. I've never seen the disposable ramekins. Yeah. Always the ceramics. Well, you know, you're there not you gonna, go. you're not, uh, these we've been molded, so you don't necessarily need anything to serve it in. Okay. It's going to set your oven at 300 degrees, hot water in there, a little saran wrap to bake it in, 30 minutes in the oven, you're laughing. And away we go. Okay. Now, Magic. Uh, so that's how it comes out. Beautiful it, consistency. We're going to put a little bit of the sugar on top. No, that's how Dino that. comes out. Mine would look completely <laughs> deformed. My, yeah, mine would look like scrambled so, eggs So, and the in process form. for doing the top of the creme brulee, for yep. those who haven't tried it before, what is the secret? Just get a nice little even layer of sugar on there. Right. And then we're going to take the handy dandy torch. You may not have one of these. And you know what? If you do get one, be careful. You can, yeah. yeah. Don't try and do this with your lighter. Everyone can plumb at home, too. <laughs> yeah, that's right. With your you lighter, get... Eckford, really, and you're wondering why yep. your creme brulee has never worked out? No, I'm kidding. So we're just going to give a... You don't want to get too close. You want to burn the sugar too much. Get a nice little layer of caramel on there. And that's how you get that nice, crispy ah. exterior. Pretty, right. pretty. It's pretty on there. And we're just going to take this now. I'm going to transfer Bring it to the over. plate right there. And tell us again what you've set on the plate there already. What have you done so to the prunes? So these are prunes. They've been uh, steeped in a little bit of tea. Yeah. And then we make a little syrup with Armagnac, 
and uh, sugar, and we let What's them sit. What's Armagnac? Armagnac is uh, it's one of the older types of brandy they have in France, and it's from the Armagnac region. Oh, so wow. it's uh, similar to cognac, but it's but it's Armagnac from that region. So and a really simple process to very make. Very simple things. process. Oh, yeah. and, really cool. uh, you could do this at home. And then you're going to put a little scoop of the uh, honey ice cream on top. I of have pre-tasted that. Have you? Honey, honey and what ice cream? It's delicious. Just honey ice cream. Just am I putting it just right on top? Just right on top. See, Mike, yeah. I didn't really wreck it. Oh, and that was lucky because <laughs> it totally <laughs> fell out. And then a little twill, and you got perfect shot on there. Look at that. That and away you looks go. so. Yeah. Beautiful. Uh, I'm guessing people uh, should probably think about reservations, reservations for, for dine out time, uh, this time of year. Definitely. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, and it's the whole menu you guys are doing for dine out. Yep. Yeah. So check it out, the Observatory Restaurant atop of Grouse Mountain. Make an experience of it, people. Of course, they are uh, part of Dine Out, which is happening until February 5th. You can oh, go to the sure. website to find out more information. Once again, make your reservation. But they have fresh snow, so there's lots of stuff to do on Grouse. Yeah, no kidding, man. What a great place to go and play and appreciate the beauty of the West Coast. Totally and look at me to talk and eat at the like, same time. I can't help myself. We're going to take a quick break. When we return, we're going to find mm. out about the traditions of Chinese New Year with the Year of the Dragon. Don't go way. Nummy. Weekly Bite is sponsored by Sunshine's Quality Assured Collision.